Welcome back you guys. Today I'm going to be teaching every single one of you how to make 100k very very easily. If you've got zero coins or you've got a million, stick along for the ride because I will show you how to make an extra 100k and no one minds an extra 100k. Now if you're new around here, make sure to subscribe because we are giving away £200 worth of FIFA points. There'll be free winners at 12k so stick around for that as well. Without further ado, let's get into the video. If you guys are looking to get some FIFA coins to improve your team and smash through Weekend League, check out U4GM FIFA 23 coins and you can use code RECALL for 5% off at checkout. Make sure to go check out the sponsor guys but let's get into the video now before we do get into the video i'm going to do my 1083 players pack now i'm hoping that it's going to be good is it going to be oh we got a special card it, it could be good Kane. oh that's a ramsdale do you know what i'll take it he was very very good in that game i will take it it's an 85 in form we can't complain we got lewandowski good to one Trippier, we got some good fodder there, I can't lie. Trippier, I've, I've found him in a lot of packs recently. Uh, we'll, we'll take it, but let's get into the trade. Some of you will only have like a thousand coins or maybe even less. Now, if you don't have a thousand coins, go through your club, sell some consumables and build your way up to a K and then come back here because you do need at least a K. Now, you can obviously go play some games to do that or do it whichever which way you would like to do it, but you're going to need a thousand coins to start. Now, of course, first of all, if you go on this filter, we've got Premier League, Man United and Gold Common. Now, for this one, at 800 coins, you're going to be easily selling these on, probably up to 850 which means you can go all the way down to 650 to 700 for sniped now you do have the option of doing this as a sniping filter and of course as bidding i'm going to show you both so first of all let's try a bit of sniping bear in mind these are gold comments what i would say is oh i was going to say they might take a while to pop up but we got one literally straight away so the only reason i think these will take a little bit longer to put up is simply that a lot of people will get a gold common and either store it in their club or quick sell it there's not a lot of people i'd say you're probably looking at 60% of the cards that have picked up gold common are probably not being sold. And the 40% that are being sold, hopefully we're going to get our hands on because right now we are not doing a good job of it. In all fairness, you can go up to 700 because you're selling these guys on for about 850. EA tax of that is 50 coins. So if you've only got a K, you're making 10% of your entire balance per card snipe so that's obviously ideal now obviously there is you know quite a few have came up we've seen two that we've missed miserably but there is obviously another way of doing this and that would be through bidding now for bidding on these guys i've put it up to 650 and you just want to bid on every card now i would suggest bidding them up to 500 coins because it's so close to what they sell for that not a lot of people are really going to bid you past that and also because they are simply just gold comments from united there isn't really a, a really big reason for people to specifically seeking these cards out you're actually going to be quite benefited by the fact that they do instantly sell on for about i mean 650 you saw they were selling on a moment ago instantly if i wasn't getting them um realistically 750 is still an instant sale where you're not going to get an instant sale realistically um is if you go kind of to the 850 mark that's going to take probably half an hour 40 minutes to sell the rest of them will be sold within the first 20 minutes which is always a win now you can see with the max prices change you do get a different selection of players but we do have some Maguire's here he does go for a little bit more i think than the rest of them but if you bid up an entire two pages of these i can guarantee you you're going to be walking home with quite a few van der beek is also one who goes for a little bit more obviously yesterday in the video if you did see it going from zero to a mil and um, we did actually do a load of bidding i actually managed to pick up 10 of the french cards but we only bid on like 30 so it actually was a really good little session there you can see dallo gets outbidded a little bit quicker so dallo's one you might want to go a little bit higher on you might even go up to a k on him because he is worth a little bit more so something you can mess around with if you get the chance and you just have some spare time is the brazil manager filter now for this one if you can pick up anything that is 4.6k and below and um, so any of these guys that are 4.6k or below you are going to be looking at 200 coins profit so it's actually a really good one to be doing because it's really easy um, i think it's 150 coins profit at 4.6k but there will be some of these listed way below that now obviously he's the only brazilian manner on the manager on the game but it's a good little thing to play around with while you are making some coins if you find that some of the filters you're using feel a bit tired feel like you're not really getting any cards this one you can just sit on the end of compare price no one can be above a 5k anything that's 4.6 or below is profit so it's a pretty easy one just to mess around with so moving up a little bit in the scale, we obviously want to go for filters that are going to make us more coins. So one that always comes to mind in this scenario is if you go gold rare, center back, Syria and Inter, you'll find Bastoni, De Vrij, and then you've also got Skriniar. So you want to find filters that have similar rated cards, but also a little bit isolated. So it's going to be easy to snipe a load in a short amount of time. So I have talked on this one a lot before. One that I do really give myself credit for because I was quite gassed when I found it um, was the Senegal Premier League and Chelsea. Obviously, you've got the likes of Mendy, Koulibaly there, and both of them have shot up in price because of SBCs recently. So if you put yourself at the 20k mark, you'll see there's no one there. 22, you're just about scraping on the Mendy. So bear in mind, he's 86 rated. That is absolutely insane. The card prices 
prices have gone nuts recently, which fair play, you have rose card prices. It's a shame that they're editing stats in the background because you can almost give them credit. But, you know, I digress, we won't give them credit. So 10% is 2.2, so we half that, you get 1.1, which is EA tax. So we go down by 1K, you're 100 coins off a of profit there. So at that point, you're making 150. If we go all the way down to here, you're looking at 900 coins profit, which is actually quite a nice mark for profit. Now, realistically, right now, 86s and 87s and 88s are the hot kind of potato. They are the thing that everyone wants to get right now. So, you know, you might take a little while uh, to get your, your hand around it if you are going on a filter that is specified to those um, specifically. But you should kind of get your, your grips around it. It isn't too difficult. Um, obviously, it's just some of the snipes are coming a little bit hot and fast. Obviously, as soon as ratings for SPCs change, you're going to have a different kind of gravy boat for what uh, is most important. Um, and there are some filters that have recently came into fruition, which I do want to run through. Now, one thing that's interesting on a filter that we have looked at time and time again, so I, oh, we've missed that, definitely missed that, yep. 14K. Right, we're gonna have a look at another filter while I get depressed about that. Obviously, we've got up the levels once again. We're going to Gold Team of the Week, and we are gonna go Premier League. One that we do look at a lot is Arsenal. Now, that one now has Ramsey in it, which is a very interesting addition, and it will make the filter go up a little bit more. But we also have the absolute filth of Newcastle. And so we've got Shaw, and you've got a couple other players. I think Newcastle's special cards, you've got Gamerez. Um, I believe there was another one. I'm, I'm, I'm convinced there is another one. I feel like, am, am I right? Is it special cards, maybe? Ah, there, you've got Bruno Carreras. It's not that one. Definitely not that one. I'm convinced there's another special card, but I might be wrong. But regardless, if you go to gold uh, or special Premier League, Newcastle United, you're going to want to look at around 17k. There's nothing there. 19k. Um, yeah, there you go. You've got Wilson. I knew there was another one. So for these guys, informs at the minute have skyrocketed as well. EA, as I say, you know, one thing they are managing well is the market. Unfortunately, players, not so much. I was upset to see what they did to Ebro because it does make you assume that maybe things like Di Maria and other cards that kind of fall off after a little while might have had a little bit of dabbling but you know we've got to deal with these things so you're looking at about 19k for the sell-on 10% of that is 1.9k half that you'll it's it's 950 I think coins but you might as well just do a k so if we go down by a k and um, we're just about getting profits 50 coins not enough that's 300 coins profit which isn't bad at all so 17 750 is a good mark we've got a wilson there straight away um, and we're gonna knock that one up for 19k i assume people just didn't realize that one was profit because it is just on the mark but 300 coins is definitely not something to complain about so that is another thing that i would say when you are trying to build your coin balance don't be precious about what you are sniping. I know a lot of people are like, oh, well, it's only making me like 100, 200 coins. The thing with a sniping filter is that it isn't going to make you the max amount of coins it can possibly make you at any one time, every single time. The minimum you want to be making is 300 coins there. But just as you saw with many there, when you can maybe be looking at like a K profit or something, you can still get seven or eight K a slide. It is just about what is listed. And that's the whole thing of the market. Now, if you want to make yourself a bit more exclusive to higher profits, you're just going to miss out on the little ones. And what that does mean is over an hour period, if you're going for the big profits and I'm going for little and big, I might miss one big card, but you're going to miss a load of small ones. So you'll actually probably end up making less coins. If we were to go, you know, back to back in an hour, I'm probably going to make more because I'm willing to take those smaller profits as well. And that is something that is a little bit important. You need to be be willing to, to down cut with some things because you will be getting, you know, you, you'll be spiting yourself. Um, now, another thing we can look at because of Ramsdale coming in is gold team of the week, goalkeeper Premier League. You've got Messalia, you've got Leno, ex-Arsenal, you've got Ramsdale, we've got Han, uh, Henderson. Um, you've definitely got a couple plays here. So definitely, if you're building up the ranks of coins, this is a place to go next because you want to be staying at the similar values. You don't really, like I, I get a lot of people um, and don't get me wrong, I don't, I don't mind answering these questions, but I get a lot of people asking what they should do if they have like four or 500K. Do the same filters because if you're if you've got if you're trying to make 100k for example just do the same filters because you're going to make 100k it's just sometimes you might all right let's if you go snipe and bappes right and you make the minimum profit you're going for 50k then yeah fair enough you're gonna make 50k a snipe you might only get one every two hours but you'll make 50k a snipe so 
going up in terms of the budget doesn't necessarily actually up the profit all the time. So we're sat at 13.5K here. I'm gonna say we can sell on for 14. We'll go, that's 300 coin profit. Just to be safe, we're gonna go there. It's about 500 coins. Now, there's a ton of players on this filter. Henderson being the cheapest. You've got Ramsdale, Henderson, Misalaire, um, Leno. So you've got a ton. There's a lot of options. Now, Ramsdale, I feel like, is the least likely to come up, even though he's in packs right now, purely because he's a little bit more expensive. But you've got a really good filter here to bolster your coins. If you are on a low amount of coins, you're absolutely golden. Run through this video, use the bidding methods, use the sniping methods. Have a look at that compare price of the, the manager and you are good to go. Now, I haven't unfortunately got a, a, a snipe on this filter, but I want to get this video out on time at 8.15. It's currently 8.01, so we're, we're going to be pushing it. But I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.